Try not to hit any pedestrians. Jackpot! High five! Don't leave me hanging. Ha! Oh, hey, it's my friend. Wendy! Uh, you guys aren't gonna tell Stan about this, are you? Dipper! <laughs> what? Yes, yeah. Aren't you gonna get in on this? I, uh, don't really dance. There it is, fellas. The condemned dust to dawn. Uh, are you guys serious? Yeah, we're all gonna die. Chill out, man. It's not as bad as it looks. Come on, Dipper. <laughs> okay, okay, just, 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 uh, gotta get a foothold. Let me take a crack at it. Oh, yeah, I can't get in, but I'm sure a junior here is gonna break it down like Hercules. Come on, leave him alone. He's just a little kid. Go, Dipper! Punch that metal thing! Hey, Dipper, take it easy. <laughs> yeah, man. Nice work. You know, Dipper, I wasn't sure if you could hang with our crew at first, but... You're surprisingly mature for your age. Everybody, wait! Whatever is doing this has to have some kind of reason. Maybe if we could just figure out what it is, then they'll let us out of here. Uh, they'll let us out of here. Yeah, that makes a lot of sense. I don't know, guys. Maybe he's got a point. Dipper, what do we do? Quick, in there! <laughs> what do they want from us? Revenge, I guess? What did we do wrong? Okay, let's try to figure out the pattern here. Why was each person taken? Tambry was texting, Thompson was playing a video game, Lee was being sarcastic. It doesn't make any sense. Yeah, I mean, those are all just normal teenage things. Wendy, say that last part again. Normal teenage things? Of course! Stay here until I get back. Dude, what are you doing? So much. Evil! What? What happened after everything went crazy? You are not going to believe it. The ghosts appeared and Dipper had to... Uh, and, um, Dipper just grabbed a bat and started beating ghosts down, left and right. And then <sighs> the ghost got all scared and ran away like a couple of little girls. It was insane. No way. <laughs> <laughs> Dr. Fun Times. Well, I'm probably scarred for life. Yeah, that was pretty crazy. I think I'm gonna go stare at a wall for a while and rethink everything. Hey, next time we hang out, let's stay at the Mystery Shack, okay? <laughs> next time? Yeah! Yeah, let's let's hang out at the shack! <laughs> Great news, Wendy! I got somebody to cover the concessions for me! That's awesome! You can hang out with me and Robbie! Robbie, you remember Dipper from the convenience store? Wendy! Hey, Dipper! We're gonna go sit on the couch! Meet us when you're done! Oh snap! I love this song! Oh, hey, man, what's up? What are you doing here? I mean, wouldn't you rather be out on the dance floor? Uh, in like, exactly 42 seconds? I'm just waiting for the bathroom. Um, uh, okay, uh, small talk, small talk, small talk. So hey, let's say everyone at this party gets stuck on a desert island. Who do you think the leader would be? I, uh, I think I'd go with this lunatic. <laughs> <laughs> I'd probably go for a stretch over there. Uh, because tall people can reach coconuts? Speaking of tall, want to see something? Those are my three brothers, and I'm... Boop. <laughs> you were a freak! <clears throat> yep. You know, kids used to make fun of my birthmark before I started hiding it all the time. Birthmark? Uh, no, it's nothing. I, 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 why did I say that? No way, dude. Now you have to show me. Show me, show me. The Big Dipper. That's how you got your nickname. I thought your parents just hated you or something. Hey, I guess we're both freaks. <laughs> <laughs> Wait here? Of course. Hey, Wendy. There you are. Hey, what happened to your hat? Uh, nothing. Hey, look, what's that? Whoa, check it out. I don't know if it's a duck or a panda, but I want one. One panda duck coming right up. You gonna go, man? And a one, and a two, and a oh! Ah, oh, dude, you missed. Did I? You're a stuffed creature of indeterminate species, miss. <laughs> oh, awesome! There you are, Wendy. Hi, Robbie. 
So I was wondering if uh, you. Uh... Look what Dipper got for me. Whatever. Can't even tell what species it is. Stupid. It's his deal. Psh, looks like I came to the fair with the right guy. We have a winner! Anytime, Brosif. <laughs> <laughs> that was even more awesome the third time around. <gasps> Funnel cake! Let's go get some, Dipper! This is the best present ever. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, man. Pick me or whatever. Hey, Dipper. Ugh, I left my jacket here again. Shut up, Robbie. Of course he's not going trick-or-treating. You should come to this party with us. Tambry's parents are out of town, and it's going to be off the chain. It's at nine. Don't forget. Hey, Dipper, are you coming to the party? Okay, then. You're coming, right? Cool. See you there. Hey, Dipper. Wendy! I didn't see you at the party. Where were you? Uh, I, uh... I was trick-or-treating. With my sister. Yeah. Mm, the party was lame anyway. Robbie ate a lollipop stick first and had to go home sick. <laughs> so, hey, you want to go chuck more water balloons at Crunkle Stan? I'd love to, but I got to spend the day doing tryouts. We're looking for a new assistant lifeguard. Hey. <clears throat> hey. What if I was assistant lifeguard? That would be so much fun. You're totally in, dude. You just have to check in with my boss first, Mr. Poolcheck. Come on, Wendy. You can't do this to an old man. Sorry, Stan. It's not up to me. <laughs> Actually, it is. Hey, Wendy. I got the job. Sweet. Want to go abuse our power? But nah. Don't worry, man. You just got to be sneaky about your rule breaking. Race you to the no running sign. Cool, <laughs> 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 Jack. Hide. 100 points. Dude, with this job, you and me are going to be having fun all summer. Hey, doofus, you never guess what happened. I just got fired. Yeah, I guess pool check found out I was taking too many snacks. Hey, want to go break rules somewhere else? <laughs> hey, well, you know all those boy bands are fake, right? Dipper's right. They're just a manufactured product of the bloated corporate music industry. You're making my dance sad. There's probably a machine that mass produces them. Oh, or maybe the boys are grown from pods. Yeah, pods, <laughs> totally. <laughs> Ugh, girls. I know, right? Check it out. These black lights make my teeth look scary. It's like a crime scene in my mouth. Come on, you love it. <sighs> it's not fair. Finally, I meet someone who can help me solve the mysteries of this town, and Stan confiscates their card. Dude, I probably shouldn't be telling you this, but I'm pretty sure Stan hides, like, everything in his room. <sighs> if I go into Stan's room, I could get in so much trouble. Yeah, you're probably right. That's what makes it fun, dummy. I'll keep an eye out for Stan. You go rustle through his weird old man biz. We're on our way. <gasps> Sorry, Dipper. I got distracted. Kid, why did you call those agents? Now go enjoy the rest of the party. Because when it's over, you're grounded. <sighs> that was nuts! You ruled back there, man! <laughs> <gasps> Mabel, let us out! Oh, I'll let you out, Dipper. As soon as you tell Wendy that thing you've been waiting to tell her, you'll thank me for this later. What is she talking about? Nothing! <laughs> Mabel's just been eating raw sugar packets again. Nah, nah. That's besides the point! Let me out right now! Ugh, where are the lights? Ah! Ugh. 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 Dipper, just say whatever Mabel wants you to say so she'll let us out of here. Wait, what? Dude, where are we going? <laughs> what do we do? Wendy, I... I... I'm gonna find another way out! Hey! Let's go! You leave him alone! Ah! Give it back! It belongs to Dipper! Hit her with the axe! Don't listen to her, Dipper! She's the shapeshifter! I, I, I don't know who's who! Give me a sign! Look, Wendy, about earlier, in the heat of the moment, I might have said some dumb things and... Can't we just pretend none of that ever happened? Please? Dude, dude, it's okay. I always kinda knew. Wait, you did? <laughs> yeah, man. 
I mean, you think I can't hear that stuff you're constantly whispering under your breath? Oh, oh man. Listen, Dipper, I'm, like, super flattered, but I'm too old for you. I mean, you know that, right? Uh, Mabel said confessing would make me feel better. Well, how do you feel? Anxious and scared and kind of itchy. <laughs> Dude, don't be itchy, man. Let me tell you something. This summer was super boring until you showed up. I have more fun with you than, like, practically anybody else. And if you ever stop being my friend, I would, like, throw myself into the bottomless pit. So things won't be too awkward now? I just wrestled myself, dude. That was awkward. If you can handle that monster, you can handle a little awkwardness. <laughs> friends? Yeah, dude, friends! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, and hey, Dipper, see you for movie night tomorrow. Your place this time, okay? Come on, Dipper. You just gotta roll with Mabel's craziness. It's what makes life worth living. Puppet boy! Whoa, like a real concert concert? I've, uh, I've never actually been to one of those before. That's because you've never had an awesome crew to roll with before. When you're with us, you're in. Sorry you guys had to see that. Ah, this is brilliant. The perfect way to sneak cheap snacks into the concert. And it was all Dipper's idea. Let me get that for you. Wendy, I'm so glad to find you. I thought everyone I knew was gone. Hey, hey, it's okay. We have each other now. We shouldn't stay out in the open for too long. Let me show you my hideout. We were playing Truth or Dare in the cemetery when it happened. The eyeballs froze Nate, Lee, Tambry, and Thompson. Robbie almost got away, but had to pause to take a selfie. What about you? I was in a fight with Mabel when it happened. Uncle Ford asked me to be his apprentice after the summer was over. But that would mean I wouldn't go back home. It would mean growing up without Mabel. Oh, dude. Mabel didn't take it well, and she ran off into the forest. She couldn't even look me in the eye. Come on, let's get some fresh air. Toby, you watch the camp. The end of the world. Man, those death metal album covers got it shockingly right. You know, I used to think I could get out of anything, but this? The journals are destroyed, Ford is captured, and I can't find my family anywhere. Bill said it himself. There's no room for heroes out here. We lost. Look, dude, it's not over yet. You've beaten Bill twice before. Why is this time any different? Because then I had Mabel. Then you need to get Mabel back. Look, this summer, I've seen some amazing things, but nothing as amazing as you and your sister. I don't know if it's dumb luck or yin and yang or whatever, but when you two work together, there's like nothing you two can't accomplish. You just need to make up and team up and save the universe. But how will I ever find her? At least the air here is breathable. Dude, you're talking to a river. Oh, hey, Wendy, what's up? Thought you were busy wrecking the school or whatever. Yeah, that got old quick. And this music is really starting to get on my nerves. I think that stuff you said about this place is right. Really? Well, now we just need a plan. Don't worry. You always think of something. <laughs> you know, you're so much smarter than, like, everyone else. <laughs> it's kind of funny. If you were older, you'd be, like, my dream guy. Wait, do you really mean that? Wait a minute. In this place, you can be any age you want. If we were the same age, maybe you and me could, I don't know, actually be together. Wait, really? I bet if we asked Mabel, she could do it right now. In this place, it could finally be just you and me. Come on, man. Just take my hand. Wendy! <laughs> Shut up, you guys. What? But it's like 80-something degrees out today. Can it, Zeus? <laughs> <laughs> Hey, you mean a lot to me, man. You too. Something to remember me by. Oh, and this. Read it the next time you miss Gravity Falls.